Meanwhile, the Nigerian immigration service is commissioning some facilities which include lounge, service mechanic workshop, and 36 well furnished junior officers' quarters for the junior cadre of the service. The Controller General of the Nigerian Immigration Service, Mohamed Babandidi, said the commission aims to show respect to all cadre of officers in the service, as everyone is important, and to motivate the officers to be diligent and comfortable in the charging their official duties. Details in a moment. In a bid for more advancement in improving the welfare of their junior officers, the Nigeria Immigration Service has commissioned some facilities for the junior cadre of the service. The facilities include lounge, service mechanic workshop, and 36 well-furnished junior officers' quarters. Look at the job, you will see a very good job. In the name of God, I hereby commission this garage. So in the name of God, I hereby commission this while commissioning the facilities, the Comptroller General of the Nigeria Immigration Service, Mohamed Babandede, said the commission projects will motivate the officers to be diligent and comfortable in discharging their official duties. Uh, in the public service, we need to understand that every part of the chain is important. Uh, as the CG is important, so are his deputies, his assistants, and going down to the lowest level of officers. Uh, if we want to get results, we must take care of the officers at the lower level. And one of the lower levels that nobody thinks of are drivers. Either they are going for investigation, or they are driving their senior officers, or they are going on patrol, or they are going special duties. We need to consider them as human beings. Uh, that driver also has no comfort place. Nobody thinks of him. But with the lounge available, uh, during the time when they are not needed, they can read. There are opportunities for drivers to further their education. They can do studies online because they are not driving at that time. Uh, also, they can relax. It's only when they have a relaxed mind they can be able to drive their spheros. They will be able to drive in an operation. If the driver is not composed, he will cause problem for those who will carry it. So it's a great opportunity for us to demonstrate that. And I hope other agencies of government will consider the lowest level of workers when it comes to investment of such nature. So we are replicating everywhere in the country to make sure that the junior officers are comfortable to do their job. The Controller General also added that the service will embark on building and commissioning other facilities for senior cadre of the service. In the next one week or two weeks, I expect the minister to also commission some projects for high-level officers. If you look down, you see the officers of senior officers well-colored, uh, well taken care of. These are ACGs and controllers. We have been able to build uh, offices also for transit camp. The minister will commission that uh, later on for senior officers also who are on posting. They don't need to wait for them to get a place to stay. They can stay in that place before they get accommodation. We have done a lot of transit camp, uh, in, especially at the borders. We are concentrating more at the borders where officers stay in a very difficult condition. We have developed and uh, built many transit camps of this color, of this nature. Uh, in addition to that, we have uh, developed port operational base where officers could stay outside the non-border patrol area. The Nigeria Immigration Service has over the years recorded varying achievements. It is hoped that other government agencies will emulate this trend in order to make office environment comfortable for their staff.